Hey everyone, Friday! Congratulations, you made it. I made it. We all made it. Is the mic working? The mic is working. Alright. Anyway, uh, this is your Friday episode of GeoGuessr. Real quick, before we start, I kind of guess got 100% lucky with that Russia guess as a comment from the video before said that actually this was a flag of the Karache Cherkis Republic, which is inside of Russia and through the power of my editing I'll put a flag of the Karache Cherkes Republic right now and then a flag of Azerbaijan right now and if I feel like it'll put a bolt together we'll see but you can see how they're 100% stripe wise and all the colors the same it's just the thing in the middle is different so thanks for the clear up I uh, appreciate it let me hit this button Hit that button and let's continue, shall we? With uh, we started with 20,000. We're hoping that we get another one. The one before it was 20, and I know that this is another terrible America picture, and I am very annoyed just because mm, I would like to have something in here to be like, hey, cut the shit with these. Uh, Real bad pictures. And I'm not going to say this in Montana, even though I really wish I would. Just because of all the past... Past three or four we've gotten have been shitty quality. Montana. I don't feel this is Montana, though. I really want to get farther down the road and maybe see a root sign. Then we'll go from there. But until we find it... How'd your week go? Congratulations. You made it. Um, I'm happy I made it. I... Hold another muscle in my back because my body is terrible. My God, where are the robot bodies? Give me one right now. I would take one in a heartbeat. I did it. I hurt muscles in my back by drying my leg. And the time before I did this where I really did a number to myself. Can I get on this road? No. I almost feel like a flood plane, maybe. Where I really did a number on my back, I sat down. My body's dumb, I hate it. I really wish it wasn't an issue. This is all the information I need that tells me the junction of where we are. Never gonna see it. Quality's too terrible. So, I'm just gonna put, like, here. And just get, like, 2,000 and just be like, well, this is, this is going awfully. Mm. But, bodies are dumb. Muscles are dumb. I wish there was an easier way I could, like, talk to my body and be like, listen, there's no reason for your muscles to freak out like this. All you were doing was just drying your leg. I mean, come on. There's so many different times. Quality's a little better. Maybe I can get something here. I doubt it. Yeah, this junction. I'm never, I'm never going to see it. Fucking God damn it. There's a lot of things. I'm like, hey, that one time, I don't know if you guys have ever pulled a muscle or, you know, maybe even slept funny. Like, there was a time I fell asleep with resting my on my side with my hand resting on my arm with, like, my elbow out. And my arm was like that for probably, like, a good hour, and I woke up and, you know, I wasn't able to move my arm for a while because it was just stuck in that position for a while. If you just, like, tell your body, like, yo, I get it, but you can not like, overreact or tweak a muscle just by doing something dumb, like maybe sleeping with your head tilted to one side. You slept funny. I'm sure you've done it. And, like, a muscle gets pulled just from sleeping. It's it's terrible. And if you haven't done that, my God, you're so lucky. God bless you. Hello, John Deere. Tell me where we are. You're not. I got 40 seconds, and this this is about as good as it's going to get. This is going to be a terrible score already. I just know it. I really, really hope that this quality... No, it's not any better. <sighs> get me down the road here. I got a little bit of time. Give me a junction. You're not giving me a junction. What if I clicked over here? Quality a little better. However, in five seconds, I'm not going to get what this is. 
If this ends up being Pennsylvania, I'm just going to be upset. We're getting more hills. Well, we're in Iowa. It's just a dead picture zone. I'm no stars. Just because. Hotel stop. Well, we, uh... Where are we in Brazil now? This is 100% Brazil. I'm calling it now. This horse, he runs this town. Now it's just a matter of, these are weird roads. It's like road next to road next to road. I mean, I've seen these before where like road next to road because one road's a major highway, the other one's kind of like a local thing. But this, this is clearly not it. Okay, scra scrap metal. Help me out. You're not. But maybe it's just a sign of me getting older that, hey, pulled muscles, maybe that maybe that's just going to be a thing. I really wish it wasn't the case where, you know, robot bodies fix all of this. I mean, yeah, there might be some bet issues where maybe I can't play with magnets anymore because, you know, I do that so much now. Or lightning strikes could destroy my body. I still got a brain. It's fine. It's not that big of a deal. Oh, maybe this will tell me. Tell me some things. Uh, Cascavel. All right. And we're on the bow constrictor vista that it's the boa view appreciation. I'm going to click here and hopefully let's see if I see a uh, road sign somewhere. I know the trick for knowing these are major roads in Brazil where exactly we are. I just need to see. Because everything always starts out with the two letters. They got the rotary here, huh? Rotary Club. Musical. Integration musical, huh? Doesn't help me. It was a fancy roundabout, I think. I didn't know they had a Rotary Club in uh, Brazil. Is that like a secret organization? Like, quote-unquote secret, like people call... Uh, Lions Club, They, I don't know if they have one of those where you guys are from. I just always see signs for it. The Lions Club, there's like Elks Club, where the only instance of Elks Club I know is this guy's family goes and it's just an excuse to drink. You pay like dues or whatever you want, and it's a kind of a little hall area they call their own. They can rent it out for like parties or whatnot, wedding receptions, things like that. But really, it's just uh, a place where older people just hang out and get drunk. I mean, maybe there's bingo one day a week. But they always do like, yeah, we do volunteer stuff, but mainly we're just hanging out and getting drunk. Because what else are you going to do on a Tuesday at 5 p.m.? Go home to your family? You see them all the time. Just take, just take a week day for yourself. And train your kid once he's 15 to uh, drive everywhere. Drive you everywhere. Under the guise of that time you got to do for a learner's permit. No, I'm not talking from experience. What are you talking about? No, shut up. It is. This is just Brazil. I don't know where Brazil. I'm just hoping that I click close to Brazil. I'm gonna click there. Make my guess. All right, we're there. Twenty thousand. Well. This is actually good quality. This very easily could be England, and this also could be Russia. I know it's Europe. This is France. Where some the sortie ends. Sortie shut. It probably just road ends. Where in France are we? Don't know. Never been to France. I had a friend who went to France once, and they told me that to go in any public pools, he had to wear a Speedo. I'm pretty sure he wasn't lying. As funny as it is to... Okay, D86. These are very tiny roads, and actually finding D86 in France. I'm going to see how far I got to zoom in. Yeah. Look at how... Well, look, found 85. Is there any logic to these roads? <laughs> Probably not. But do I even close, zoom in more to see? 
Oh, I don't. Okay. There's 85. If I just dumbly happen across D86 here, which isn't going to happen. Well, there's 87. What else we got? 86. Is it a 300? Is it 866? Oh, that... 86 and 866, huh? Oh... This isn't gonna help. Should I stop trying so hard with this short amount of time? Because I gotta zoom in a ways to see this. Alright, let's... Let's keep going. La Maison Rouge. I know what that means. I'm not gonna tell you. It's real goddamn obvious. These are really tiny roads, and I don't feel any direction I'm gonna go is gonna get me closer to a, uh... Bigger road? So, I'm just gonna keep going this way. And this nice... This would be kind of fun to drive on. I wish this was a dirt road. It'd be more fun. But... Take what you can. Hello, tiny villas. This is probably... So it is prudent, rulers, dos mes. I don't know. Well, D eighty six cone de brie. It's a cone of brie. It's cheese. We're going to cheese cone. Not. I'm not gonna find eighty six. I don't think this is this is very difficult. I'd like to think I'm kind of in the same. I don't even know where I am now. Oh, I'm over here. It'd be cool if I just happened upon it on dumb fucking luck, but I know that didn't happen. Minute four. This is a very tiny little section of town. There's like four houses here, and they just call it a village. Sure, fine. I always had an, oh, uh, an interest in what actually caused cities to build up where they did. I mean, a lot of it always centered around bodies of water just because it was a port, maybe, where all the boats finally decide, yeah, we're all gonna go here. Now yet, that looked like a German flag, which made me a bit concerned, thinking that we're closer to the border of Germany and France, but, yeah, see this right here? Is that just the German flag because we're close to the German border? I haven't seen any Franco-Germanic Wording anywhere. We got 14 seconds. The fort doesn't sound too uh, French to me. Well, let's just take a click over in the one second. How close was I? Oh, so it was farther up north, huh? Let's see if there's a D. Oh, there's V4 D86. No way I was gonna get that. But I always wondered how some other places, like, figured out where their, uh, towns were gonna sprout up, just because it seems a little different. Yeah, there's no water around. Why did we, uh, agree to this? Oh, now we're gonna blur. Uh, this, this could be, this could be... This could be Brazil. Could be Mexico. Is there a thing on the side of the road? There was not. Alright, let's, uh... You are an interesting, potentially, Toyota. I don't know what you are yet. Like, those four houses just sprouted up there. They didn't feel like there was anything really near there. They're like, nah, yeah, these these three houses, we're, uh, we're, we're, we're going to uh, just live here now. This is a root. However, you're blurring these out for me. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. Uh, 1T or 17. Route 17? I don't know what country this... Come on, get me on the road. I gotta see what this sign says. Nothing. Oh, this sun is bad. Um... Cordova. Sounds like Santa Fe. This doesn't. This does. This nope doesn't help. Still don't know the country. Well, let's just go. I need to find more signs and information. You are a Chevy. 
So, oh, here we go. Here we go. Um, 190. Hmm. Could this be Mexico? Could. I need to see one of the little road markers. I don't know if I'm going to. I don't feel like jumping too far ahead because I might miss it. But I'm running out of time here. And this truck full of cows isn't going to help me. Mercedes. Got nothing. Yeah, this, this, I, I don't know what this is. And I'm running out of time. If I had to make a guess. Uh, these tr type of trucks. Are they a Mexican thing? I don't know. I really need. This looks like a signpost. That'll give me highway information, but it seems to keep getting away. Here we go. Nope. That doesn't help me. I got a minute. I have zero idea what this is. This feels like a temperate climate, which makes me feel like it's not Brazil. And maybe it's Mexico. But I've seen nothing that's going to help me. That doesn't tell me. Is this a... Uh, I almost thought that was a cemetery, but it's not. There's cornfields here. This feels like fall. This is going to be a terrible score. This is going to be another bad round. I'm a little annoyed. I got 20 seconds. I got a... I got a... A Surma. I'm going to say this is Mexico. In the 10 seconds I have. Uh, this jungle here. More desert here. Maybe here. This is going to be like 4 points. I'm... I already know it. Whatever. Yep. Yep. This has just turned into such a... Like, I didn't see anything. It was just one long... I saw Cordoba. Woody Woo. I couldn't see any road signs. I had nothing. This is... I haven't had, like, this bad a score in a very long time. This is a bad week. And hello, Scandinavia. Like, Argentina has really fucked me. Is this Iceland? I saw a sign. No, I will not start singing that song. I'm not in the mood. Look at this score. It's pathetic. But I was on a straight line of road with, with temperate climate. Maybe, maybe that was a sign. If it's that temperate, it's far enough south from the... Uh, Lagerfeld. If it's that far away from the equator and it looks that deserty or, or, or temperate climate, like I would see where I live, maybe that's another sign I could use to say that it's Argentina. But uh, I don't know. I'm losing it. I mean, I've been doing these for sixty some odd episodes here, and nothing's nothing's. Really, like, not, I might, nothing is stuck. Like, my quote-unquote skill has not really gotten any better over the process of doing these things. In fact, like, I've only been able to second-guess myself. All right, so, yep, I know what country this is. Unless this turns out to be Greenland, which I don't think it's going to. We're in uh, Iceland just because of this letter here. Uh, I think I've talked about this before where Icelandic is a very difficult language to learn. It's one of the hardest. And the only reason I really know that is because there was a... Uh, this guy, I forget what the hell he was called. We're, we're near water. We're not in Reykjavik. This guy who was like really smart, or had like a photographic memory or something like that, would, uh, spent, I think, a weekend, and he learned Icelandic, like, perfectly, and then went on to an Icelandic TV show. Oh, like, Friday he went on, and I guess he said, I might be misremembering this, but the, the general gist of it was, like, 
Friday, he went on this TV show in Iceland, didn't know a lick of the language. Monday, came back, spoke it fluently. Like, this guy has one of those photographic memories where you can say, all right, what did you do at 12 o'clock, January 13th, 1989? And say, well, I was doing this. It was sunny out. It was, uh, well, this is the one, which is the only highway here. Well, there's there's more than that. But it was he, he can tell you everything that happened that day just because he has that type of memory. And they kept making a big deal out of the the fact that, hey, this guy learned Icelandic. And I know that, like, this little dot line, it's like a difference in the way you would say TH, the, the and them. I think that's the only way I remember it. Granted, I did a huge report on this in grade school, and there's probably a lot of it I have not remembered since then, but I'm pretty sure, like, Eggleståthir? Stat Maybe it's Stathir, and I'm remembering wrong. If you know Icelandic, please clear me up on this. Like, I won't, I cannot say that. Kerkujibejarklakstur. I'm never going to find Igris, Igris, Eagle Stadir. But I got the I got the island right, I think. I got the island right. I'm two for two on Icelandic guests, guesses here. And I'm going to give it five stars because this is Iceland. But this is just an awful, awful score this time. Oh, mainly just because of this one. 26 points. I, it stumped me. It did its job, GeoGuessr. Congratulations. I started off so well, and maybe by next week on Monday, I'll, I'll get four points. But them's the breaks as I hit the microphone because I have no skills in any of this stuff. Clearly by the, by the score I got, but hey of the week down use this as a uh guy to be like well at least i didn't get this when you go into your weekend no matter how shitty your week was you didn't get 26 points on a guess um but that's gonna do it for us this week at uh hobby fist here um I'd like to thank you all for watching everything we had done this week even some of the bonus stuff i know there's a couple of uh videos for twitch there'll be one later today but for some reason when I've been streaming, I'm getting frame drops horribly because of the reboot of my PC. I'm still fiddling with that stuff. But, uh, yeah. Check out the Twitch stuff. See some of the other stuff we're doing on the channel here. Thank you all for watching. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe. Again, if you got any other tips, like the that, that one guy did about telling me the difference between Azerbaijan and that region close to it in Russia. Love to hear that shit. That's interesting to me. And I uh, hope all the stuff's interesting to you. But till uh, Monday comes around, have a good weekend. We'll see you then. Goodbye. <laughs>